oldest artificial ice track on the planet, is the venue for the eighth and final round of the Wiesman Women's Skeleton World Cup. The first of two heats kicked off by Australia's Michelle Steele, the only athlete in the field still using the double-handed start. As she left the start area, she slid into freshly falling snow. A good run through the Chrysler is vital on this track. Michelle skidding her way down through the labyrinth, but setting the marker for everyone else to chase. She won last year in snowy conditions. Noel Piker's pace, though, was glad of a second start draw. The short start area doesn't hinder the American girl too badly, and a great run through the Chrysler set her up for a fantastic speed at the bottom of the track. She took the lead by six tenths of a second. But at this stage, the snow was still falling lightly. Janine Flock of Austria with a bronze medal in Eagles, the first Austrian skeleton slider ever to win a World Cup medal on their home ice last week under her belt. She had another solid performance. A little high in the second wave in the Chrysler led to more skids down the bottom. She wasn't the first and she wouldn't be the last to do that, but she moved into second spot as the closest challenger to Piker's pace. Germany's Sophia Griebel has been in and out of their World Cup squad this season, but the youngest member of the elite of the German sliding world put together a good Kreisel and bottom end to put herself into medal contention. Great Britain's Shelley Rudman, former European champion, has had mixed success at the Koenigsegg track. And again, another tall, but slightly lighter athlete. She felt the snow hindered her on her run. A little mistake off the Chrysler saw her lying half a second back, but in a strong third position. The local heroine, she lives in Bischofswiesen, just up the road from Koenigsee. Anja Huber, representing Bavaria, 2008 world champion. A little wavy in the Chrysler, but she got the exit right and put herself right in the frame. Tied for fifth with Sophia Griebel. With Piker's pace four tenths in front and Janine Flock and Shelley Rudman her closest rivals, the second heat looked to be a stormer. But as the snow got heavier and heavier, safety meant that there would be no second run. Piker's pace, Flock and Rudman completing the podium on the results of the first heat. With Sophia Griebel and Anya Huber tied and taking out the non-Europeans, Janine Flock of Austria became the European champion from Shelley Rudman, Griebel and Huber. But the World Cup standings saw the four-time race winner and seven-time podium finisher Lizzie Yarnold claim the Crystal Globe for the first time ahead of Noel Piker's pace and Shelley Rudman.